So dark energy is not to be confused with dark matter, as they're actually completely different things. Dark energy is basically an energy in the universe which we haven't measured directly yet. So the universe is thought to have begun about 13.6 billion years since the Big Bang and has expanded since. And one of the main aims of cosmologists is to measure the rate of this expansion. So initially people thought that the universe would either be expanding at a constant rate or it would be decelerating under the gravitational attraction of the mass within it. However, since the 1990s, we've had a number of pieces of evidence which has suggested that the universe is actually accelerating. The first robust piece of this evidence was the measurement of the brightness of very distant supernovae. Basically, it was found that these sources were fainter than expected and therefore further away. And this was used to predict the fact that the universe was actually accelerating. So just to describe this, here we have a plot of distance as measured by the supernovae's brightness against redshift, which is an independent measure of di distance, which is basically defined by the cosmology of the universe. So a straight y equals x line on this plot basically shows a universe which is expanding at a constant rate. Below the line, it's decelerating, and above the line, it's accelerating. Now, these black points are basically the measurements from the supernovae, which suggest that the universe is expanding. And since then, we've had another bits of evidence which basically agree with this result. So how does this relate to dark energy? Well, basically, to have an acceleration, you require a force. And to have a force, you require an energy. So therefore, there must be an energy in the universe which is driving this acceleration. And as we don't know what it is, we call that energy dark energy.